Hi, we're Rainy Day Dreamers. And we're back with another game review. Today we're checking out A to Z. Rainy Day Dreamers. Rainy Day Dreamers. A to Z. This game was sent to us by the Toy Insider. Thank you for sending us this to try out. We can't figure out from the box exactly how it works. It seems like some kind of a quiz or puzzle game that involves typing on here and lights going out and a countdown timer, so we're excited to give it a try. If you're looking for this and can't find it locally, I'll put a link to it down below this video. Roxana has read through the instructions. You think you got a handle on this? Okay. This is the electronic part of the game. I've put the batteries in it. The cards and instructions fit in the panel back here. And yes, there are cards. This is basically the alphabet with some buttons for the player numbers up here. And as near as I can tell, correct me if I'm wrong, what this does is keep track of which letters you've selected. That's mostly it, right? That and score and so and time. Timer. Okay. So here's a card we might draw. And these are the categories starting with famous battles of World War II. The machine will tell us which category to pick. And then when we start it, we have 30 seconds to think of as many answers that fall within that category, press the letter on the, um, the keypad and it will keep track of that. And the first person who does goes through all the letters in the alphabet wins. Is that right? Yes. Okay. And then you keep taking turns, you alternate, right? You get one 30 second turn, I get a 30 second turn until one of us goes through all the, all the letters. The one thing I don't understand with this, because I was expecting it to like already know the answers, is if it's famous battles of World War II, and I tell you the Oriskany. Do you know if that's a famous battle of World War II? I don't think I know any battles of World War II. She isn't going to know. So, okay, we'll see how this works. So, go ahead. I think you hit a button here, right, to tell how many players are going to play. You have to turn it on first. Okay. Gives you game music. Okay, right. so players. Player. So we have two players. Yes. So that player means... Player one. Do you want to player one or do I need to player one? We're figuring it out. So I'm going to read you the second category in this card. You're going to press that and then you have 30 seconds to punch the letters for answers and I try to guess if they're right or not, right? Right. Okay, okay. so category two on this card I is... I can read it too, you know. It's not it's a secret. secret. It's not a secret. The password for today is... Things made of glass. Hit Things your button. Made. Come on, no thinking. <laughs> Hit the button and go. Okay, um, 30 seconds. Um, Things made of glass. Window. Okay. Um, what's made of glass? Oh, glasses. Where's... It's getting faster! Um, <coughs> what's made of glass? I don't... Cups? Sometimes. And that same thing as God. I don't know anymore. They seem to be disappointed. <laughs> you can see here there are two letters that are not lit up. Those are the two that she selected. She's got to go through the whole alphabet in order to win before I go through the whole alphabet. So go ahead and hit the button for the next player, I guess. They want to know which player, right? Okay, it knows it's my turn. And that means category six. So pick up a card and read me category six. Wait, wait, wait. What do I press when I'm ready? The number six? Yeah. Just okay. start the timer. Wild mammals. Wild mammals. Well, dogs can be wild. Whales are mammals. Dolphins are mammals. I already did dolphins. Um, elephants. Mm. Elephants. Tigers. Leopards. Uh, cheetahs. Uh, boars. Um... Da, 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 da. Now I'm kind of hold like Anteaters, X, Y's, and Z's. Wow. <laughs> Zebras. Okay. They liked what I did with that. <laughs> as many as I got. Okay. Now we can know what we're doing here. So go ahead and press the number two. It's flashing. And let's see what number category. Category one. Ready? Category is... Basketball stars. Are you kidding me right now? Hey, you went to the Globetrotters game. You don't remember any of those names? Are, does that count? Sure. I'll let it count. The, the game doesn't know anything. It's just whatever your other player or players say is okay. Basketball stars. I have an idea of one, but I think he's a skateboarder. Um, Start your turn already. Come on. All right. Get it over with in do 30 I seconds. Do I do the Globetrotters? Does so that count? Any name of any basketball player. Go. Okay. 
um, tea time. And okay. I, I tried, okay? This was a long time ago. Um, cheese. <laughs> there might have been a guy in the glove powder called cheese. We'll let you have that. Oh. Now you see, before she had the two letters out, now she has four that are darkened because she added two more this time. Oh, no. Slang words for the police. Slang words for the police. Okay. Well, there's cops, but I've already done that. Pigs, the man, that M. Um, if it's two worded things, you just choose the first okay. from one of the words. Narcotics officer and narcs. Jack booted thugs. Uh, mm. They seem to like that, though those were offensive terms for the police officers, and I apologize for that. Here's how I'm doing. Go ahead. Free. I'm free. No, you're free. Yes, that does something. I don't remember what that does. I don't remember what that does. What does it do? What does Hopefully it do? does involve basketball Turn stars. Turn off one of your letter lights. Oh, you get oh. a free letter. Oh, it's a free letter. So I pick an XYZ or something that's, you know, you're not likely to get otherwise. Okay. There we go. Oh, this is a good one for you. Children's television programs. Children's television programs. Sesame Street. Um, hmm, Mr. Roger, no, that wouldn't be an R, um, if the Muppets, wanna... um, Dora, oh, I've used up so many letters, Arthur, the electric company, and now what bonus do they give you? Oh, no, no, hold on, I have 15 seconds, press the blinking, 15 seconds to what? Well, read what? that first. It's going to take your turn to turn back on as many as your home's player lights as you want. As many as you want? You can go turn on all my lights again? Something like that. Just play the game. In 15 seconds, you could do them all. We go play the game the same as normal. Except instead it shows me your board. And I have to try to think of many things that start with the letter of the ones and turned those, off. Uh, and I turn those on. I get it. All right. <laughs> Yes. Things found in a bathroom. Go. There's soap, towels, rubber duckies. Ducky, sure. Um, bathtub. Yep. Okay, we got what, three? It booed me? It's booing you no matter what oh. you do. Okay, so here's how I look after she did her steal. Mm -hmm. Category three, internet terms. <gasps> Anything related mm -hmm. to the internet, go. Re click. Yep. And it's my turn? Okay. Um, LOL. Never mind. Okay. BRB. K work? Sure. I don't know any others. Okay. Category two, water sports. Go. There's skiing, waterboarding. <laughs> okay, I know what you mean. A, is that not a thing? No, I understand what you mean. Yeah, otherwise it's not a sport. It's not very sporting. Names of department stores. Okay. Have I, Q, and R. <laughs> Sears, Kmart, Target, Pennies. Q. R? There's Ross. Is that a department store? That's a clothing store. I don't think of that as a department no. store. Fred Meyer. Up in Seattle. Department store is starting with these letters. Category six. Types of meat. Alright. Um. <laughs> Red meat. Okay. Is there such thing as orange meat? <laughs> Not a generally recognized type of meat. No. Since it's fairly possible this game is never going to end, we're each going to do one more round, and whoever is doing better at that point will call the winner. Go ahead. Turns out we each ended up with four lit letters, so it's going to be a tie game. So, Roxana, A to Z, electronic, what did you think? I thought it was actually pretty fun. 
The problem is when you don't know if your answer is right and the other person doesn't know. It sounds like maybe that was the right answer. That's kind of the downside of this is that it doesn't know the answer, so you have to work it out amongst yourselves. Also, we played for over half an hour and we didn't finish one game. Yeah. Because of the stealing and because of some of my inability to get better answers, it just sort of goes on and on. So I think at that point they should have some way of just, you know, hit a uh, sudden death overtime sort of thing and whoever gets the next two answers, then they get to win, something like that. But we just decided whoever had the best score at the end of one more round. If you can't find this locally and are interested in it, I'll put a link to it down below this video, and we'll be doing some more game reviews soon. You can keep checking back for those, or you can click that subscribe button down below. You'll get notified when our videos go up, and you will join, join the, the Dream, dream team. team. It's raining at our house. Is it raining where you are? Private day to stay in and play, or eat a big chocolate bar. Hang out with friends till the weather ends, and you don't have to go too far.